Rouge Pelt was fought with natural obstacles in addition to armed battalions. The most notable of these obstacles was Xantippe's Abyss, a yawning bottomless chasm that spanned a continent. There was some speculation that the chasm was not natural at all, but that in the early days of the war, one side or the other had, in its reckless enthusiasm to wrench the resources from the ground, simply cracked the planet in two. Oh my god. I'm going to... That is beyond aggravating. That is absolutely annoying. Those missile launchers just descended on that Bertha and destroyed it. Even though they were protected by a squadron of freaking gunships. Words cannot describe how annoyed I am right now. I hate these missions that I have to protect something or I have to capture and hold something. Just let me destroy it. The game is called Total Annihilation. Let me totally annihilate everything. Uh, the, tonight is just not my night. I keep getting stung by these missions. Okay, let's... We're gonna go vehicles. Just... Uh, I need the fastest builders that I can get my hands on right now. The fastest builders. I specifically had the, that squadron guarding the freaking Bertha so that it doesn't get destroyed if it's attacked. No, it still got destroyed because the missile launchers attacked it from outside of its range. Oh, that's so annoying. Oh, that's so annoying. get all the metal we can get number three this is the second mission today where actually no, I think I had to restart every single mission today and none of them were ex exactly difficult I just keep getting sabotaged by these details like don't get don't let something be destroyed or don't destroy it yourself So it's my mistake that I'm not saving more often. I should definitely be saving more often. That is absolutely true.
Uh, how much are we doing? 9.8. from vehicles well all of the basic stuff okay almost done with advanced uh, vehicle plant by the way, there is a, a mod for Total Annihilation, uh, Total Annihilation 3D. Just kind of ironic because the game is 3D, but it's top down. Uh, somebody made a mod where the, you can rotate the map. As in, you can pitch it down. Because this top down perspective is something that was kind of the default back in the day. But it was default because. Uh, the games were 2D. So this game was uh, kind of trying to, you know, ease everybody into the, day, uh, the, the 3D spectrum. Gently and slowly by offering the same point of view. For some reason that's also the true, I think, in Supreme Commander 2. Probably in Supreme Commander 1 for it as well, as well. I didn't play that much Supreme Commander 1. I've played quite a bit of Supreme Commander 2. Okay. But if help that uh, build that up, it's still gonna take a while because our economy is very much starting. This is a problem for this thing because uh, will we be able to pathfind around? You will. I'm amazed. But actually, how about we use you? Pick up these rocks, get some extra metal out. And every one of these is a rock, unfortunately. They're really small. And each one gives you a bit more metal to work with. Right. Rebuilding these mines for the third time on this mission. When I get to Total Annihilation Kingdoms, that's gonna be uh, interesting times because uh, I've mentioned this uh, earlier. There's like 50 missions in there, and some of them last literally a couple of minutes, and some of them can last for hours. Okay. 
Okay, let's build this up. Now, we do have missile launchers, right? We do. Perfect. We're gonna be using those this time around. attack is going to show up at certain point. the economy the easier and faster everything goes now vehicles do build up faster I don't know what exploded but something exploded Start building these up. Oh, that's right. On this uh, mission, there are meteor showers. And yes, it is possible for the meteor showers to destroy the objective. It takes a lot because the meteors are peppering randomly and uh, they don't do all that much damage all at once. Uh, but yeah, it is absolutely possible to lose the objective to meteor showers. Heavy assault tank, yeah, we want those. Set now. Uh, this thing in the middle should be the. So let me save the game. Okay. Hold fire.
Okay. Capture that. The good thing I saved the game where I did. Come on, capture it. Perfect. Ooh. Fix it, fix it, fix it. Oh no, you won't escape from me now. Or well, maybe you will. Important thing is, we've defended it. Right. I need an, another... Oh, I don't even know what, is, uh, uh, what to say anymore. Radars there. Where's my? There it is. Put the radar over there. Let's build a plasma cannon here. But the plasma cannon will not be able to fire effectively through those. So better this instead. There's a meteor shower. Fire at will. Fire at will. There we go. Much better. power and the uh, fusion plant is still being built might as well build a couple of more power plants until the fusion power comes online Bertha can't really even even fire in this position as in there is no power in there to power it Until the fusion power is ready. This is finally now going as it's supposed to. Uh, I was planning to do a lot more missions than I did. 
all the restarts didn't help. guys forward as well because those missile launchers will probably be returning at some point maybe uh, now an airport for some scouts might be a good idea or I can just fire these things blindly they don't need to survive none of them do Once this fusion plant is done, I'm I probably going to start building another one immediately. But then I can start using the Bertha. Don't really need any more of these guys, at least for now. We're just there for... True. Oh, of course. Fix that. Fix that. Then come back. Ooh. Let's build our own. What's it called? Instigator. Intimidator. Yeah, let's build an intimidator. Did you destroy what you were supposed to destroy? Yes, you did. So we're just gonna let it loose. Its accuracy isn't the greatest, but that's fine. Missed what I was telling it to hit, but it hit something else, so it's all good. Oh, there we go. It destroyed what it was supposed to destroy. <laughs> and that's it. Jeez. Oh, that took more than it should have. <laughs> 